In this video, I'm gonna show you how to use HTML comment syntax to create comments in your HTML so that you can leave notes for yourself or for other developers that are working in your HTML pages. And we're getting started right now. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. It's Bjorn from Higher Learning Lab, where we help you get better at coding so you can earn more for yourself, for your clients, or for your business. If it's your first time here, make sure you click on the subscribe button and then click on the bell notification icon so you're notified when we publish more awesome tutorials for you. And with that out of the way, let's get into the screen capture of this tutorial. I'll see you there. So it's really quite easy. And the reason you do this is to annotate what you're doing in your code so that you in the future will know what you were doing in, in the past, you won't have to think too much about what you're doing and try to figure it out. You know, it's written there. Or if somebody else comes and looks at your code, say somebody you're working with, somebody on your team, or you pass the project on to somebody else, they will be able to, at a glance, see what you were doing and why you were doing it. So to create the HTML comment, all we do is we type in open pointy bracket, exclamation mark, two dashes, and then we close it by having two dashes and we close the uh, the pointy bracket. So as you can see, uh, what happened when I added that last pointy bracket, the text went from gray back to syntax highlighted. So here we see the comments not complete. Everything below it is gray when it's grayed out like that. That information does not show up on the page. We add that last pointy bracket, all the coloring comes back, we're good to go. In between these dashes is where you add your comment. So this is an HTML comment and we save that, we refresh this page over here, and we see it's not visible. It's like it's not even there. But if we view the source, we see that it is right here on line number eight, just like it is in our code, line number eight. And that's how easy it is to use HTML comments in your code. I hope this video helps you. If you haven't done so yet, click on the subscribe button, then click on the bell notification icon so you're notified when we publish more awesome content. And then click on that card that just appeared in the top right of this video for some awesome resources. And until next time, keep crushing it, and I will see you in the next video.